the service is just one of the reasons why so many wanted to take part in tonight's event. We've moved inside. We're joined by somebody who will have a huge part to play this <laughs> evening. So no pressure. It's actor and comedian Ahmed Jalili. And uh, welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Do you normally wear this on a, on a Sunday, <laughs> on a Sunday or, evening? Uh, <laughs> this, is the, the, this is the Herald's costume. The Herald was always a, a friend and a confidant to the, to the monarch of the time. And uh, this was the only thing that fit me. And uh, apparently it was worn by Timothy West and he as Henry VIII in 1979, and I can tell you it still smells of tin salmon. <laughs> <laughs> What's your job then this evening? We've been watching you over yeah. the past couple of days. Well, my, my job is to actually, it's different from the host. The hosts kind of do all the presenting, but the, but the Herald kind of comments on what's going on and keeps the audience kind of uh, connected to the action. Because it's not just, as you can see, it's not just horses. There's, there's comedy, there's drama. There's amazing music, and then the Herald kind of keeps everything together. And what was it like when you were asked to do it? I mean, what does it mean to you to be taking part? And it's a bit of history tonight. Isn't it, it is. I think it's, it's, it's... Everyone in the cast is very aware of the occasion, because this isn't just a once-in-a-generational event. This is something that probably never happened again. And it's a real chance to be part of something that we know was designed to give Her Majesty a, a, a real fun night. She loves horses, she loves drama, she loves comedy. So it's, it's, to be part of something like this is, is history-making. And you got some big laughs as well. Yes, Prince Edward said to me, I've been here for many years. No one's had a single laugh. How do you do it? What are you doing? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> He's a bit annoyed by it, actually. And we've had a, a variety of members of the royal household yes. and their guests here this week. Just uh, take us through what you've seen from your position. Yeah, it's great because we can see them. We, we had uh, Pr Princess Anne was there yesterday and she looked visibly moved by a, a few things and yeah. she was laughing. And she, and she afterwards as well said to me... Uh, she said to me, um, did, did you seriously volunteer to do this? Why, why would you want to do this? I said, it's an honour, because it's, mm. it's all madness, but you did very well. Thank you, we loved it. And, and she goes, Mama will like this. That's the thing. It's, so it's, it's designed for the Queen. And, the, and it is all of the, the things that the Queen yeah. loves. Will you change your show at all because Her Majesty is in the audience this evening? No, I think that at the end of the day, it's the, it's the horses that matter. And uh, it's quite funny, some of the horses go walkabout. They, they lost one of the horses today, and they found him <laughs> a mile up the road outside his stable trying to catch up with Eurovision. It was, it was hysterical. <laughs> they just found him. It was amazing. <laughs> and for you, what are, your, um, what are the things that you've enjoyed and that you've, uh, you've watched? Because uh, there's some things that will yeah. strike awe into you. Yeah, I think at the end of the day, there are people watching this. You know, Britain is, is such a diverse place. There are people who love the monarchy, people who don't like the monarchy. But there are parts of the show which actually will get you roused and make you feel very proud to be British. And whatever you say about... The, the Queen did say on her coronation that however long I live, be it long or short, I promise to serve my people and the country. And mm. she's done that. So whatever you think of the monarchy, she has been steadfast and stayed true to her word. So it, it, even from a human point of view, just to be here to respect her and give her what she wants is a... Is a real honour. And, and there is a bit of a free song in the air tonight. The yes. fact, you know, we're awaiting to see Her Majesty the Queen's arrival, some pretty yes. mega names here as well. Yeah, there, I mean, Tom Cruise is here as well. Is he? Yeah, I've just met Tom Cruise. Wow. I, mean, I don't know if that's a, was that a surprise. We've just been in his Winnebago. <laughs> <laughs> For bigger than our houses combined. <laughs> and he's very charming. I was just talking. He looks amazing. He, he's, I think he is he cryogenically been like preserved. He looks he looks like he's 15. He's a very he's handsome guy. And what's very. more, he'll be sitting in that seat in a matter of moments. So yeah. be careful what you say, because you may pass him on the stairs. I will. Okay. <laughs> but good thank luck you. tonight. I hope you enjoy it. Thank yeah, you. Good have luck. a good night. Thank you. Great to see you. Right, well.